follow me. When I think about Jesus saying, follow me, during different times in my life, I can divide those times into three different segments. I was raised in the First Baptist Church of Deep Run, North Carolina. My paternal grandfather built the church, and my father and mother were charter members. So during my early years, following Jesus meant every time the church doors were open, I was expected to be there. It didn't matter what the service was, the function, or the event. I was expected to be in church. No questions, no excuses. So I really didn't understand what follow me meant back then. The year that I turned 13, I listened as Jesus spoke to me one night during our fall revival. He specifically said, follow me. And I accepted him that night as my Lord and Savior. I joined our church and I began to somewhat understand what follow me meant as I started my own faith journey. Over the last 54 years since that night in 1966, I have heard Jesus say, follow me, more times than I could ever count. Happy times, sad times, doubting times, trying times. He has always been there for me, even times when I really wasn't sure he was there. Today I know that my faith journey is a lifelong journey, and it will continue until the day Jesus says, follow me into heaven. At that point, I'm pretty sure I'm going to know exactly what follow me means.